Hi, it's Courtney Daniela. I am a YouTuber and a Cambridge graduate. And here are, why did I say graduate like that? Oh, turning graduate. into my mum. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> here are my top 10 tips to power up getting into Cambridge. If you can, go and visit Cambridge. It is a beautiful city and there are so many opportunities from individual college open days to the university open days, but also specific days for black students where you can ask questions, particularly surrounding the experience of black students at Cambridge University. There are over 30 colleges at the University of Cambridge and each of them has its own unique culture. Some colleges are more popular than others. Loads of people are going to be applying to the really big old colleges. So do your research about the smaller colleges. And if you just don't want to go through that hassle, apply to Robinson. That's where I went. It's great. There's only one you. You are the best version of you. So use that to your advantage, whether it's being black, being a woman, being from a working class background, you have a unique perspective on the world. And you can use that in your essays, in your exams, in the way you speak even to your interviewers to let them know, I have a unique perspective that you need that's going to allow us to think more broadly about the world. So bring that way of thinking to Cambridge. Don't think you need all A stars to be able to get in. The truth is there are a lot of people who have A stars across the board who actually don't get admitted into the university. If you're applying, then you're smart. And if you get an interview, they know you're smart. Your grades say you're smart. The truth is they're looking for people who are passionate about the subject, passionate about the university. And that's all you need to worry about conveying. Take a look at all the courses that the university offers. Some subjects are more popular than others. Cambridge opens so many opportunities for you and so many doors for you. So don't limit yourself right now. You're only 17. When I was at school, they used to tell us that they were going to throw a brick out of the window and ask us how we would catch it. I don't know, I don't do physics. The truth is your interview is just a conversation you have with an academic to see how well you think. Display your unique way of thinking. Talk to them about how your life has shaped your perspective. When I had mock interviews to help me practice, they were a train wreck. I was asked if I knew who Angela Merkel was. I didn't have a clue who she was. I was so discouraged about going to my interview. I thought I was going to make myself look like an idiot. I missed my train and I ended up getting to my interview late, but not later than my interviewer. Don't do the same mistakes that I did. Go there boldly. And when you really sit down and you relax and you don't worry about it as much, you actually start to enjoy it. Even if you are painfully shy and you find it hard to talk to people, just take your time. You're so young, they understand that this is quite a high pressure situation for you. Get used to talking to someone, whether it be your parents or your siblings, about the things that interest you and see if you can actually convince somebody of an argument, even if they have no prior knowledge of the subject. If they can understand you, then you've mastered the art of communication. Don't be put off by the grandeur of the place. Take it in. They're just buildings. They're brick and mortar. At the end of the day, Cambridge isn't the buildings. It's the people. I didn't let that voice, that voice telling me that I couldn't, that I wasn't from the right background, that I didn't have the right parents to be able to go to Cambridge. I didn't let that voice stop me. I've been able to apply this mindset of what if I can actually make it to everything else in life. If you want a life secret, not just how to power up and get into Cambridge, but how to really get through anything, start thinking more positive. Could you actually get in? Yes, you could, but give yourself the opportunity to. Even if you are a black student who thinks Cambridge is not for me, stop putting yourself or Cambridge in a box and start thinking I have so much that I could bring to this university that would be great for them to have me. 
So those have been my top tips. Now I'm not saying they are everything you need to be able to get into the university, but hopefully when you click that link to apply or to find out more about the University of Cambridge, you feel a bit more confident that you are the right person who deserves a place here. I'm here rooting for you. Fingers crossed you get in and let me know if you do.